Hi. How are you doing, Sean? Are you doing fabulous? I really genuinely hope you're doing fabulous today. Okay, listen, I am very excited for a number of reasons. But first things first, I want to get something out of the way. I originally wanted to watch Annie for today's video, but <laughs> because of the DVD that I have, I've had that for years and it's gone through some abuse. The poor DVD, it looks like it looks like it was given to a puppy to chew on. Yeah, it's it's gone through some stuff. But then the the copy, the DVD copy that I have behind me, right here, is um Blu-ray, and I can't play Blu-ray on my laptop. So, <laughs> but the reason I wanted to watch it is because it's Carol Burnett's 90th birthday on the 26th. So sp spread some love in, in the comments, in the chat, whatever, to Carol because she deserves the world, okay? She really deserves the world. And if I was gonna take a bullet for any celebrity, it'd be Carol Burnett. Like, Carol Burnett or Tina Turner. Like, I would take bullets for those women. They just, they really deserve everything. I love them so much, okay? But they are not the reason we are here today. We are here today because on May 20th, it's going to be Cher's birthday. And for that, I think I'm gonna have to do two or three videos with her in it, okay? Two or three. Girl, I lost like half of my intro footage. <laughs> That's hilarious. Anyway, <laughs> this is after the movie, but it's fine. Um, I was literally just about to say like, Faithful. I didn't, I didn't even say what we were watching. Faithful, 1996. Like, I knew that um, husband hires hitman to kill wife because he doesn't like her anymore. I don't know. I really can't say a whole lot because I've already seen the movie. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, this is gonna be a real short intro. Yeah, I literally, basically what I said was that I love Cher and that she could look in my direction and I would probably faint. You know what, I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna be very dramatic here. I'm gonna be very dramatic. She, Cher, could split my spines open with a box cutter and I would say thank you. Excuse me? Oh, yes, I don't think you understand. I am obsessed and this movie is amazing, but just watch the video and then <laughs> you'll be up to speed. Oh, uh, like get into this and before we do, thank you for being here. Cause you can be anywhere but here with me watching this movie and I'm very blessed. And if you want to grow the moon, <laughs> if you want to grow the movie community, like and subscribe and ring a need a words bell so you don't miss any of the shenanigans that I upload. And if you don't like, share the door. Yes, Faithful, 1996. Let's watch. <laughs> seen a Miramax film in so long. It is ridiculous. I have never seen that logo in my life. Mm-hmm. Palmentry? Palmentry? I don't know. How do you pronounce his last name? Help me out. <laughs> Excuse me, ma'am? Ma'am. Y'all got money. Y'all got money. Get it all for him. What? Chaz wrote it? What? Robert De Niro produced it? Dude, okay, I would love to see this. Like, I feel like it'd be so much fun to see this on a sta as a stage play. But I feel like I gotta, like, see the movie first. You know what I mean? Okay. Loving husband. Ad allegedly. <laughs> May he always honor her and love her. Oh my god, that's such a cute picture! No way. It's a wedding? I love weddings. <laughs> love that. For you. I know the <laughs> Oh my god. This is so cute! <laughs> Why do I love this? And her dress was beautiful, by the way. Old, vintage. We, but we, we love, okay? Do not make me cry! Yes? Oh my god! Wait, um, um, the help, Ma, what's her name? Allison, something? Oh my god. I can't, I can't. Y'all know I can't stand to see Cher cry. Oh, hold up, wait a minute. Um, behind you, ma'am, ma'am. And this is why we look at our surroundings. This is why we carry coupons and knives and pepper spray. And I'm gonna say it, America, guns. What? Yes, cause, uh, yeah. what now, what now? Now she's being followed and she has no idea. 
incredible. You see the line, though? It's incredibly beautiful. I wonder what it costs. More than we could ever afford. Yeah, well... What That's her car, isn't it? Yes. Hey! Let's go! I called it. Did y'all hear the phone ring? Because I called it. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry they left this morning without saying goodbye. I, I just didn't want to wake you up. Or you wanted her dead. Murder? Get out, okay? Honey. Hey, listen. It's our anniversary. I know this. And I promise to take you out. And I will. But I gotta do this first. Oh, oh my god. I'm gonna fight someone. I'm gonna fight someone. He's making me mad. Like, I'm fuming on the inside right now. I'm literally... Oh. Oh, it, it, the, it, flame, flames. While there's moonlight and music and love what? and romance. What? This is not the right movie to be dancing like this. It's not right. Why do I always do that? Like, vibe out at the most inappropriate time. Why am I like this? So Ooh. Ooh. Music. Scary. Why are you holding it up to his face like here? Hold it back here so we can see it. Hello? Oh, 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 oh. Not all three of them. We got the pills, the liquor, and the cigarette. Lord have mercy. But her robe is so fabulous. I would love a pink robe like that. I want you to take it easy with that medication. I'll be fine. You alone? Yeah, I'm alone. I thought that maybe we would spend some time alone on our anniversary. Now I know I've got a heart because it's breaking. <laughs> all right, I'll make it up to you, I promise. I'm sure you will. I am so, I ain't said anything in a hot second. I am so stressed. Shut up. Ah. Put your hands behind you. Oh. Whoa. 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 Wait. 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 Okay. That was an abrupt transition. It's a natural to be with one person the rest of your life. Says you. After 47 years, you're finally getting a divorce. He took a sip of coffee, put the cup down, looked me square in the eye. He said coffee. He said, you see this watch? It's cracked. Here, look at the crystal. Here, see it? Here, come on, look at it. It's been cracked. Yeah. Relax. I need you to take the dial down just a couple notches. Relax. Because every time he looks at his watch during the day, he wants it to remind him of how much he f***ing hates her. Okay. Good for you, sir. You should have been faithful. What the hell are you talking about? I've never done anything in my life. My husband's the one that's been unfaithful, okay? My are you kidding me? Well, I, I went to dinner with the guy once. Uh, that's not faithful. I wanted to have an affair with him, but I couldn't, okay? I couldn't even kiss him. Mm-hmm. Something tells me that she's fibbing a little bit. Yes, you're very smart. Shut up. Well, obviously you've never been in love. That ain't love. Whatever this is, this ain't love. Now y'all two. I would like to see it. It didn't work out. Why? I had to kill her father. <laughs> well, I can see why it didn't work out. <laughs> That's hilarious. It's not funny. Like, her dad died. That's not funny. I was faithful for two years. Not counting. Uh, did you get married in church? Yeah. And did you take an oath before God? Yeah. Uh, thank you. You were married. If your wife met some guy on the street and she that wouldn't classify as cheating. You're really hung up on this thing, aren't you? You're the one that brought it up, sir! You're coming on to me, baby. What? Oh my god! <laughs> Your husband hired me because I'm the best. I have a reputation of a man who gets the job done and never goes back on his word. See, why are you talking out into the open where people can hear you? My husband hired you? Yes. yes. You, you seem like a man of your word. I am. He said, I am. <laughs> What? I'm a little confused. I'm just waiting for a call. From who? Your husband. My husband's gonna call you here? Yes. The way he's gonna call and signal me by letting that phone ring twice. And that's when you die, Maggie. What? No. I know that's not her name. Stop with all these questions now. Come on, you sound like my shrink. You're in therapy? <laughs> You're in therapy? Shrink can't tell anything what goes on between him and a patient. It's strictly confidential. No, no, not when it comes to murder. You're wrong. Yeah, when it comes to stuff like that, they gotta, like, they gotta spill the tea to the police. You know what I mean? You see, money takes away all your problems. Then you got no choice but to look inside yourself and see how f***ed up you are. He's got a point. He's got a point. I was told to make it look like a, a murder. 
You know, there's a five million dollar life insurance policy on you. Oh, that's some bullshit, dude. Yeah, well, he wouldn't kill me for the money alone. The other one is it? Debbie. She knows her name. And I'm so stupid, I thought that no matter what he did, he would always love me. Well, maybe he loves you, but he's not in love with you. <laughs> uh, there you go. That's, that is definitely a good way to put it. What does it feel like to kill someone? Why, thinking about killing someone? No, I... I, I couldn't kill anybody. Oh, yeah. Anybody can kill under the right conditions. Yeah. Yeah. Good evening. Did you watch me? Oh, yeah. We saw that. Yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Wait, the delivery of that yes was kind of making me uncomfortable. I watched their life just disappear in front of me. I collect my money and I wait for the next job. Dang. <laughs> yes, I did that. And you would do it too for a check. It's Paul. What up? This is... The angle is stressing me out. This is all because of you, Maria. Just shut the f*** up about my sister. Ooh, 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 ooh. This job is different, Doc. It, this time it's a woman and she's standing right in front of me. I never whacked a woman out. So he's a bit of a softy. Does your mother know what you do for a living? Bust out the big guns with her, with his mom. My mother and father are both dead. Oh. <gasps> Whoops. My sister was dating some young wise guy who got out of line, just like you. My sister just got in the way. It was just business. So they killed your sister too? Ugh, my heart. My heart is breaking for this man. Could you give me a cigarette? No. Why? Cause that secondhand smoke will kill you. That shit will kill you. They can prove it. You're gonna f***ing kill me. I think the least you could do is give me a cigarette. I think he's talking about himself. I'm gonna untie you. But if you try anything, I'm gonna kill you right here. I'm not gonna wait for no phone call. You hear me? Uh, back, back up, back up, sir. I'm the, you can back up a little bit. Oh, wow. Gotta go to the bathroom. You want a cigarette? <laughs> I'm not leaving you alone. I can't pee with you standing in the room. I love that. How they avoided the, the, the mirror by having a low angle for the... That's smart. Your husband gave me a lot of money to do this. I'm sorry it had to be you. No, you're not. Shut up. Stop the cap. Yes, I <laughs> think you're gorgeous. You're more than pretty. Every guy in my school was after this girl, except for one, and he liked me. This sweet. And she wore low-cut blouses and really tight skirts. Scumbag! You know, because you'll do anything for someone you love, except love them again. Are you kidding me? What the f*** does that story have to do with anything? <laughs> Who cares? I listened to her rant about life all day. Not now, Doc. <laughs> Why aren't you afraid to die? Go look on my desk. What? On my desk, there's a note. Read it. No! Actually? To my husband. I know that you've been unfaithful to me. I've known that for a long time. But now I know there's someone special in your life. Someone you really care about. I'm sorry that I wasn't able to give you children, but you knew that when you married me. Maybe she can give you children. I can't live like this any longer. That's why I decided to take my life. What is this? You were going to kill yourself? What? This doctor's driving me crazy. He's driving me crazy, you hear me? He bought me this book for my birthday. The Road Less Traveled. Don't forget to read the first line. I open up the book. I read the first line. Life, life is, is difficult. difficult. I feel personally attacked. Excuse me? It's white. And your point? I like how they're showing like the progression of her hair drying. I think that's really fun. I like the creamy, you got the crunchy. They had a mess with it. Peanut butter's been around a hundred years, they had a <laughs> with it and put crunches in it. Excuse me, sir? Okay, wait, wait. First of all, crunchy peanut butter, superior to creamy. Two, she wasn't expecting guests. How was she supposed to know that you like creamy peanut butter? So why are we upset? He's annoying me.
There is a hole in that bread. And I would say that you are a master of the fucking obvious. Want me to feed you? I'll feed you. I don't think she wants you to feed her, but whatever. Flashback to her wedding. Oh, honey. I'm sad. <laughs> Dreams? Yeah, I mean, like, what did you dream you wanted to be? Okay, I like this for her. She's, like, loosening up and trying to loosen him up. You know what I mean? Playing cards, shooting the breeze. Everybody respected these guys. They had it all. The money, the clothes, the cars, everything. So a gang member. You like me. <laughs> no, you do. If you weren't here on business, you would like me. Yes, ma'am. If I was him, I'd like you. For my husband, would you leave me alone for four months? Four months? No, I wouldn't. Uh would you like to? Like Ooh! Why not? I mean, you told me you've got a- Ooh! Why couldn't it be fun for both of us? That's not the no, she's got a point. She's got a point. I'm- I'm just saying she's got a point. Oh! Oh, the angle is messing with my head. What? That's me. Ah! That's me too. <laughs> ah! I'm not doing anything. Oh, but I'll say allegedly, even though I know what my eyes saw. She is being very seductive right now. Whew! I know what you like, anything. Ah, uh, but do you though? You've known each other for like a whole hour. Do you know what's happening here, huh? Do you have any idea? You've been made a fool of, okay? My husband didn't hire you, I did. What? I call Cap, there's no way. I wanna see the receipts. One more word and I and swear you know what? You're gonna kill me? No, you won't. Remember, you've never killed a woman. That's something you'd never do. Oh, she's got a point. She's got a point. She watched me. You hear what I said? She watched me climb over the wall. She saw me on the- No, she didn't. She was in the bathtub. No, this is all because of Maria. But stop blaming my sister. Seriously, stop bringing up his sister. It's stressing me out. You really want your husband dead, Maggie, huh? Yes. And how about if I take the 150000 and leave you the gun? No, you're a hitman and she gets caught. Ha! <laughs> huh? I know what happened to your sister. No, you don't. Shut your face. I never thought I'd say that to Cher, but seriously, mind your business. They are not siblings. Now it's him. my problem. I gotta pay them back. Oh my god, I'm, I'm so stressed. Don't kill him. Maria, get away from him. Done. My dice. Ah! Done. Oh my god. Ah! Ah! Oh no. Imagine that was a prank call. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, oh, my God. I can't do this! Oh, oh, ah. Stop it, get away from her! <laughs> oh, no, oh, no, oh, no, oh, no, oh, no, oh, no, 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 It's a movie about trauma. It's a movie about trauma. And the movie is about trauma. It was a study in trauma. Maria! Maria! Come on! Maria! Hold up, wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. I beg your pardon? I need a minute. Hold up. I need a minute. I need a break. I'm a little bit mad. <laughs> what? <laughs> Whew. Well, I had no choice, just like now, I got no choice. No, you do. You do have a choice. That part. That poor guy. I just can't. My heart. I never wanted to hurt you. I know that. <gasps> what? What? Girl. Girl. You just escaped death and you're... Ma'am. 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 Yeah, kind of mad because that's ridiculous. But also like, do I blame her? No. Go hug a landmine. I don't want to look at his face. I do not want to look at his face. Why aren't you asleep? <gasps> Sweetheart. Look at you! Oh my god! I am obsessed. Why are you so dressed up? It's your anniversary, stupid. I haven't seen you dressed up in a long time. You look sensational. Yeah, I wonder why. 20 years, it seems like a lifetime ago. But you look sad. Yeah, because you're not dead. Wow. <laughs> 20 years. <sighs> She does that a lot with her hand. I saw her do that in, um, Witches of Eastwick. I think in Moonstruck, too. In Mermaids. Oh, wait! They don't beat much anymore, though, do they? 
I beep at her. I would. Yes, I would. Yes, I would. Who are you to judge me? Hey, what's gotten into you? Well, for the past four months, nothing. <laughs> Have you been taking your medication? Tell her to take her medication one more time. I dare you. Don't you want to f your wife, Jack? Look, if she was my wife. Oh. You need to leave. Oh. Yes. Don't you look at me like that. I know. I know what you're looking at me like. If I was him and she was my wife. Filth. She thinks Bob's cheating on her. What makes her think that? Mm. A woman knows, Jack. Oh. So we saw in Moonstruck. A wife knows. Can one woman make a man happy? Yeah, sure. The one he can't have. Ooh. Hey, 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 watch it. Watch your words. You trying to not get caught for cheating? Watch it. I know about your little five-day excursion to Puerto Rico, okay? Your f travel agent called me to confirm the reservations. Cotton 4K. I am leaving you with Debbie and her fake tits. The tits are not fake. And how would you know that? You think she loves you? Yes. Have you looked in the mirror lately? Read him down! I remember when we got married, we didn't have two nickels we could rub together, remember? I had that shit car. We, anywhere we went, we had to park it two blocks away. I Parking two blocks away is normal. What did I do? You cheated on me. Your mother! What about Debbie? Did you f*** him? Yes. I called it! I called it, I called it, I called it, I called it, I called it! You followed me? No, I didn't follow you. I hired somebody. He's been watching you. You did what? Oh! So the truth comes out. You know? Yes. Whoa. She is really yeah. gorgeous in that shot, even though she's pissed off. <laughs> oh! Well, shit. Nobody but me. <laughs> you got me, Jack. <laughs> Who are you? You should have been faithful. Wait, 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 wait. Whoa. He is... In a white tank top. Oh my share. An Italian man in a white tank top. I can't handle it. <laughs> the way I feel right now, I want to kill both of you for nothing. <laughs> Leave your husband. Open the safe. Come on, now. I, I don't know if I remember the combination. Well, you better remember, because I'm going to put a bullet in the back of your husband. Whoa, this took a major gear shift. Gear shift. There's a lot of money in that safe. Do you want it? Yes. Oh. My. Share. Girl. You're shocked? Come on. You piece of shit. I hope you burn in hell, you Come son on. of a bitch. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Tony, how can you do this after what happened? <gasps> no way. Ah. Oh, no way. No. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. Why well, do you know she's dead? I heard the shots. Why don't you go upstairs and make sure? <laughs> How did I know? Who are you to judge me? Me? <laughs> Hi, Jack. Hey! Oh my god! She looks fabulous. What are you gonna do? Kill me? I'll tell you what we're gonna do to you. <laughs> That's hilarious that they all freeze. Listen to him. Shoot him in the back of the head. He'll die faster. <laughs> I love this. Is she actually gonna kill him? Wait, no. Unalive him, please. Bitch, what you say? You know I'll survive. <laughs> so will I. Period. Period. Oh my goodness. I love this for her. I... And you listen to me good. You ever come back here and touch her in any way, you hurt her. And next time you see me, you won't see me. No, I don't think you understand. I'm obsessed. You know what happened between us when we were alone in the bedroom? It's been a long time since I've been with a woman like that. Aww. We settled down. Maybe you and I wouldn't go out, you know, have a cup of coffee or something. You know. I like that. My little brain is going to explode! Aww. Snap out of it! And the difference is you. I love that. What? Why did I love this movie so much? Wait. End of movie? Let's talk about it. What? 
Wait, this is such a fun movie. Why didn't this, wait. Wow, this doesn't even have a meta score. Wow, okay. I'm offended. And it's a 5.8 on IMDb. This was really good. I liked this. I'm a little bit biased and we know this. <laughs> I had a good time. That was fun. I'd probably watch this again. I gotta rate this. Um, I think I would give this like a solid 8 out of 10. I would definitely give this a solid 8 out of 10. Like I really liked it. I mean, I don't know how many times I can say that, but it was such a good movie. I don't know why it didn't do so well. Like it was quite enjoyable. Although one thing I have to say is why? Why? Y'all fully escaped death. And then, like, what? We didn't see that coming. We didn't. We didn't. If you're saying you saw it coming, you're lying. Happy birthday to Cher. She's turning 77. What? <laughs> and she was 51 in this. 50. Wait, what's the age difference? What's the age difference? Seven years? It's not too bad. How in the world was he older? <gasps> what? What? He was in What's Up Dog? I love What's Up Doc. Yeah, let me know what y'all thought. I'll actually link the link the movie in the description so that y'all can watch it for yourself if you haven't seen it already. If you have a movie suggestion, put it in the comments so that I know. Um, and I'm thinking I'm gonna I'm gonna do Mamma Mia 2 next. So ignore my makeup right now. Like I was saying, I was thinking Mamma Mia 2, but I'm open to doing other ones if you guys have a preference. So if you want me to do burlesque or moonstruck or whatever, you know what? You decide which one I'm doing next. But Keep in mind, this has to be for Cher's birthday, so it has to be one of her movies. Anyway, back to what I was saying. So this one and the next one are gonna be for Cher's birthday because I'm obsessed and I love her and I want like all the happy birthday celebration to last as long as possible. If you like this video, like and subscribe and ring Anita Ward's bell and get notified. I'll see your beautiful face in the next video. Bye.